hello YouTube I wanted to come on here today and show you guys my complete fully stock nail polish rack the other video my rack was empty when my husband built it and it took me a minute because I was lazy to get all this polish sorted on here so now I finally done it and guys this is the outcome I do need a bigger one because I have so much nail polish I have nowhere to put it so with that being said there you guys let's put some light over here that is all my nail polish the china glaze the orly I got all brands I didn't separate the brands because that would be odd so I just try to categorize it by the colors instead of doing the brand so here you guys go a look at my nail polish collection Orly, Sally's, Wet n Wild, OPI, China Glaze, Sinful Colors, New York, NK. There are several brands on here, so that's why I didn't categorize it by the brands. I got a lot of Sally Henson also. Glitters. There are several. I got a lot of glitters. I was going to just put the glitters in one separate location, but that didn't work because it was too many glitters. So my daughter just said blend it in with the colors with the nail polish. So that is what we did. I didn't count this after I put this on here. I can't even tell you how much it is. But let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 80, probably 180 more or less because all the bottles are different sizes. But this is all the room I had. I told my husband I'm going to need more space so he can build me a bigger nail polish rack. That is what my nail polish collection looked like. All the colors. And then for all my extra nail polish that I had left, I had nowhere to put it. So I just put it right over here. Guys, I found these containers at Target. They're called Snapware. I just got done loading my nail polish in these. I bought one at first. After I filled them up, I had a lot of nail polish left over, so I had to go and buy another one. These are at Target for like $13, $13 and some change what it looked like after you put your nail polish in there it's not a good idea to try to lift this up and carry it because it's going to get ugly but the top as you can see has a lot of colors in there i'm not going to open up the bottom because the bottom is the same except the bottom has all nail polish and stuff these art bottles i don't have art bottles in the second one so in this top container I believe I have 96 um, nail polishes and in the bottom container I got like 84 or 85 so that's 96 plus 84 or 85 okay so the second container I went and bought today I just decided my bottom bottom one I put all the nail polish in it and then the top one I just decided to just put all my clear coats and nail treatments in it 
So, because these big bottles, I really don't have room for these. So, I just put them in there like that. Look at all my clears. What is this? Yellow stopper. Base coat. Nail hardener. And then you have the top coat. So, this um, top container will be specifically for all my clear nail polishes and my nail treatments and the rest of these containers have all my colored polishes in it again these came from target and at the video i will show you what the packaging looked like because i um for you guys to know what i'm talking about because when you go in there they got a snap where one is for cupcakes but that's only one top container it don't come with the second one and then if you don't see it you're going to have to go in the next allen target and then they're going to have these they come together just like that so i hope you guys enjoyed this short video a update of my nail polish rack that my hubby bought well not bought but built me um i'm going to try to get him to build another one the kind that go on a wall just to show you guys what it looks like if he um, ever built it. I'm not going to use it because I don't want to put any holes in our wall as you can see. So the one that he's um, going to build for like the wall, I'll probably just do a small video on that and show you guys and then I'll probably sell it or something because I'm not going to use the kind that go on the wall. I'm going to use that one. I'll have him to build me another one just like that. So, this is just my little video of my update of completing my nail polish rack. I hope you guys enjoy. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. If you guys have any questions or comments, put them down below in the comment box. You guys stay blessed and have a nice day. Until then, thank you so much, YouTube. Bye-bye. Okay, this is the container. Um, this is a new one. The new one that I had to buy. Um, I'm just showing you guys the wrapper so you guys will know what to look for. This is found in Target and you can find these out to out with their storage bins and stuff. This is what it looks like. And it comes with two containers. It's called Snap and Stack Large Organizer. And the, um, the price tag is going to be like... A I think it's like $13.59. Yeah, I think I paid like $13.59 for these. And then when you flip them over, you can see that is made by Snapware. So this is what it looks like. I'm going to try to zoom in on the UPC in case you guys want to write the UPC down. That is what the UPC is. Well, when you guys go in there and you can give UPC number to the customer service and again let you guys know if they have them in stock so again these are called snapware containers and so far I have four of them the two that's filled up and then I'm going to stuff and then these other two but I just wanted to show you guys what the container packaging looks like and it's by Room Essentials that's the name of it so these can be found in Target if you guys have any questions just put it in the box below Until then, you guys stay blessed and take care.